Solution to the first problem. 60 miles per hour, 65 miles per hour, 5 hours, distance traveled 300 and 325 miles. The, uh, the uh, distance between the buses then is 300 plus 325 or 300, 625 miles. In the second problem we subtract instead of adding. So the buses are 25 miles apart. That C is a misprint. And then the passenger train. Now that be the speed of the passenger train. And note that 15 minutes is a quarter of an hour. So the trains traveled for 3.25 hours. The passenger train, the freight train travels at 40 miles per hour less. The time multiplied the two, you get these two distances. And they travel in opposite directions, so the total distance is this distance plus that distance, which should be my equation. And the sum of the distances is 260. Distribute, add 130, combine like terms, divide by 6.5, x is 60. So the freight train travels at 60 minus 40 or 20 miles per hour. Now let's continue. The uh, Abe and the moped and Bill on his uh, Bronco. That XP the time in hours I had to build to catch up with Abe. So Abe traveled two hours more. Raise 35.65 times x plus 2x, multiply, you get the distances. One distance is equal to the other distance because the Bronco catches up with the moped. And that's your equation. So distribute, subtract 35x, divide by 30, x is 2 and a third. Bill took 2 hours and 20 minutes to catch A. So 12 plus 2.20 is 14.20 for 2.20 p.m. And then the plane. The speed from LAX to uh, Ord is 500 miles per hour, back 350 miles per hour. The distance is x. Distance divided by, uh, no, yeah, distance divided by rate, distance divided by rate is the time. The total time was 8.5 hours. So uh, you have a common denominator, least common denominator 500 times 7. Multiply by the common denominator, divide by 17, 17 goes into 85 exactly, 5 times, so 5, point, five times, uh, so 0.5, whatever it is. I multiply, to, I guess, these two and I'm dividing by 17, which gives me 1,750. So the distance between the two airports is 1,750 miles. And then finally the speed problem. Sound travels like we did before. The lightning is 20 miles and 186,282 miles per second. Sound is 0 0.2134 miles per second. And uh, the time is about one ten thousandth of a second, and the time is about 94 seconds, which is one minute and 24 seconds. So one minute after lightning strikes in Santa Monica, you will hear the sound in Long Beach. 